GitHub Copilot with Cursor AI. What is better? Let's compare and find out. GitHub Copilot. It's just add-on to any IDE. Here, for example, we have IntelliJ. So it's just add-on that can be added to your favorite tool. Cursor AI. It's fully automated tool, especially designed to work with code in AI. So you just install it and starting working. Let's create some simple prompt to both of them. To Cursor and the same to GitHub. Both are starting created here, uh, full stack, so began front-end database. In what cases Cursor are better? In which cases GitHub Copilot are better? Strengths of Copilot. IDE flexibility, as I already mentioned, so you can install on your IDE that you used to work with. It's also strong on small suggestions, so if you need something small to do, it's perfect. Code review features are really awesome, so if you are working especially with GitHub, Copilot, perfect tool for code review, it's also automatically create a lot of comments, so perfect combo to work with GitHub. Cursor, it's perfect for deep context. Multi-file awareness, if you have a really huge database, you need to make edits across a lot of files, refactoring, configs, it's good. So, small files, Cursor Copilot, super, big number of files, Cursor AI. Next trend is privacy. With Cursor, you can keep everything in private, you can store everything inside your system, code wouldn't go nowhere. One more item, AI built for AI work. So here is everything needed especially to your work with AI code for written. GitHub, perfect for small items. Cursor for big migrations, large refactors. Because Cursor can apply changes across many files, multi-file refactors. You can ask it to write models, API usage gauge or update config across all services. Cursor will do it much more better than GitHub. GitHub Copilot is perfect when you're writing a new code from scratch. Frontend or backend? Copilot is very strong in backend logic. So, if to compare frontend or backend, to check what tool to use, Copilot is better with backend. Cursor is better with frontend, because in frontend there are a lot of different models, structured services, updates, hammers across models, so it's pretty good for that. For mobile development, so now let's summarize. If you need to do some quick adjustments, quick edits, especially if your project is on GitHub, GitHub Copilot, best for it. If you have very huge system with a lot of dependencies, a lot of models, you need to do some huge migration and you need to be sure in your privacy, use Cursor for it. Thank you guys, put likes to this video and I will share more videos about AI tools. Don't forget to subscribe for my insights.